is Gila, and I'm privileged to live in the Holy Land of Israel. Last Sunday, I spent all day at the Temple Mount Conference in Jerusalem, which welcomed both Christians and Jews. It was a very interesting and inspiring day with various excellent speakers, including both Orthodox Jews and Christians, and a great musical performance from an Orthodox Jew. While as an Orthodox Jew myself, and also an ex-Christian, I am totally against Christian attempts to convert Jews to Christianity. At the same time, I know some wonderful Christians among my own family as well as friends. I do appreciate, as an ex-Christian, the impetus to spread Christian theology around the world, and especially to Jews. But if you're a Christian and you have a big enough concept of God, as my own Christian family members and friends do, please understand that the most loving thing that you can do as a Christian towards Jews is to respect our own Jewish path to God. However difficult the theological conundrum our own understanding may give you. The one infinite omnipotent and omniscient God of us all who created the whole amazing universe in which we are all privileged to live is more than capable of sorting out all our theological differences himself. Leave those up to him. Those Christians who support Israel and who respect the Jewish path to God are more than welcome. Thank you so much for your support. It means so much more than you can ever imagine. But those Christians seeking overtly to missionize and proselytize the Jewish people are frankly not welcome. I do appreciate your fervor and your genuine concern for Jewish spiritual welfare. But I would like to suggest, please, that you put the one loving father of us all first and trust him to open our hearts and minds, as well as your own hearts and minds, to his will for each of our lives. Thank you so much and may God bless you.